Arm Holdings plc is a British multinational semiconductor and software design company with its head office in Cambridge, England. Its largest business is designing processors bearing the Arm name, although it also designs software development tools under the DS5, RealView and Keel brands, systems and platforms, system on a chip infrastructure and software. It is considered to be market dominant in the field of processors for mobile phones and tablet computers and is arguably the best known of the silicon fen companies. Processors based on designs licensed from ARM, or designed by licensees of one of the ARM instruction set architectures, are used in all classes of computing devices from microcontrollers in embedded systems a euro including real-time safety systems, smart TVS and all modern smartwatches a euro up to smartphones, tablets, laptops, desktops, servers and supercomputers HPC. ARM's Mali line of graphics processing units is used in laptops, Android tablets and smartphones and smartwatches. It is third most popular in mobile devices. ARM's main CPU competitors include Intel, Imagination Technologies and AMD, and its GPU competitors include Imagination Technologies. Qualcomm and increasingly NVIDIA and Intel. Qualcomm and NVIDIA combine their GPUs with an ARM licensed CPU while Intel doesn't. ARM has a primary listing on the London Stock Exchange and is a constituent of the FTSE 100 index. It has a secondary listing on NASDAQ. History, name, the acronym ARM, first used in 1983, originally stood for Acorn Risk Machine. The processor from Acorn Computers, its first RISC processor used in the original Acorn Archimedes and one of the first RISC processors. However, when the company was incorporated in 1990, the acronym was changed to stand for Advanced RISC Machines in the company name Advanced RISC Machines Limited. Then, at the time of the IPO in 1998, the company name was changed to ARM Holdings, often just called ARM just as the processors. Founding the company was founded in November 1990 as Advanced Risk Machines Limited and structured as a joint venture between Acorn Computers, Apple Computer and VLSI Technology. The new company intended to further the development of the Acorn Risk Machine processor, which was originally used in the Acorn Archimedes and had been selected by Apple for their Newton project. Its first profitable year was 1993. The company's Silicon Valley and Tokyo offices were opened in 1994. In 1997, ARM invested in Palmchip Corporation to provide a system on chip platforms and to enter into the disk drive market. In 1998, the company changed its name from Advanced Risk Machines Limited to ARM Limited. The company was first listed on the London Stock Exchange and Nasdaq in 1998. Apple's shareholding had fallen to 14.8% by February 1999. In 2010, ARM joined with IBM, Texas Instruments, Samsung, Street Ericsson and Freescale Semiconductor in forming a not-for-profit open-source engineering company, Linero. Acquisitions, 1999, Micrologic Solutions, a software consulting company based in Cambridge, 2000, Allen Software a developer of debugging software, Infinite Designs, a design company based in Sheffield, Euromips a smart card design house in Sofia Antipolis, France, 2001, the engineering team of Neural Micrologics, a debug hardware and software company based in Blackburn, UK, 2003, Adelanti Technologies of Belgium, creating its Optimo de Data Engines business, a form of lightweight DSP engine, 2004, Arx's Design Automation, a developer of ESL design tools and artisan components, a designer of physical IP, the building. Blocks of Integrated Circuits, 2005, KEIL Software, a leading developer of software development tools for the microcontroller market, including 8051 and C16X platforms. ARM also acquired the engineering team of Power Escape. 2006, Phalanx, a developer of 3D graphics accelerators and Soysic, who specialize in developing silicon on insulator physical IP, 2011, Obsidian Software Incorporated, a privately held company that creates processor verification products, Prolific, 
a developer of automated layout optimization software tools, and the prolific team will join the ARM Physical IP team. 2013, Internet of Things Startup Sensinode, Cadden C Euro Unregistered Trademark SPANTA Family of High Resolution Display Processor and Scaling Coprocessor IP Cores, Operations, Business Model, Unlike most traditional microprocessor suppliers, such as Intel, Freescale and Renesas, ARM only creates and licenses its technology. As intellectual property, rather than manufacturing and selling its own physical CPUs, GPUs, so CS or microcontrollers. This model is similar to fellow British design houses, ARC International, and Imagination Technologies who have similarly been designing and licensing GPUs, CPUs, and so CS, along with supplying tooling and various design and support services to their licensees. Facilities the company has offices and design centers across the world, including San Jose, California, Austin, Texas, and Olympia, Washington in the United States. Bangalore in India. Trondheim in Norway. Lund in Sweden. Sofia Antipolis in France. Munich in Germany. Yokohama in Japan. China, Taiwan, and Slovenia. Technology. A characteristic feature of ARM processors is their low electric power consumption, which makes them particularly suitable for use in portable devices. In fact, almost all modern mobile phones and personal digital assistants contain ARM CPUs, making them the most widely used 32-bit microprocessor family in the world. Today ARMs account for over 75% of all 32-bit embedded CPUs. ARM processors are used as the main CPU for most mobile phones, including those manufactured by Apple, HTC, Nokia, Sony Ericsson and Samsung. Many PDAs and handhelds, like the Apple iPod and iPad, Game Boy Advance and Nintendo DS, Game Park GP32 and Game Park Holdings GP2X, as well as many other applications, including GPS navigation devices, digital cameras, digital televisions, network devices and storage. The WLAN processor of Sony's PlayStation Portable is an older ARM9. Licensees, ARM offers several microprocessor core designs that have been publicly licensed 830 times including 117 times for their newer application processors used in such applications as smartphones and tablets. Six of those companies have a license for the their most powerful processor core. The 64-bit Cortex-A57 and 4 have a license to their most powerful 32-bit core, the Cortex-A15. Cores for 32-bit architectures include Cortex-A15, Cortex-A12, Cortex-A17, Cortex-A9, Cortex-A8, Cortex-A7 and Cortex-A5, and older classic ARM processors, as well as variant architectures for microcontrollers that include these cores. ARM Cortex-R7, ARM Cortex-R5, ARM Cortex-R4, ARM Cortex-M4, ARM Cortex-M3, ARM Cortex-M1, ARM Cortex-MO+, and ARM Cortex-MO for licensing. The three most popular licensing models are the Perpetual License, Term License, and Per-Use License. Companies often license these designs from ARM to manufacture and integrate into their own system on chip with other components such as GPUs or radio base bands. In addition to licenses for their core designs, ARM offers an architectural license for their instruction sets, allowing the licensees to design their own cores that implement one of those instruction sets. An ARM architectural license is more costly than a regular ARM core license and also requires the necessary engineering power to design a CPU based on the instruction set. Processors believed to be designed independently from ARM, by vendors for whom no architecture license has been announced, include Apple's A6, A6X, and A7, and Qualcomm's Snapdragon. ARM core licensees, companies that are current licensees of the 64-bit ARM V8A core designs include, AMD, Applied Micro, Broadsom, Kaltar, High Silicon, Rockip, Samsung, and Stmicro Electronics. Companies that are current or former licensees of 32-bit ARM core designs include AMD, Broadsom, Freescale, 
Huawei, IBM, Infineon Technologies, Intel, LG, NXP Semiconductors, Renesas, Rockip, Samsung, Stmicro Electronics, and Texas Instruments. ARM Architectural Licensees Companies with a 64 bit ARM V8A architectural license include Broadsom, Cavium, and Huawei. Companies with a 32 bit ARM architectural license include Broadsom, Faraday Technology, Marvel Technology Group, Microsoft, and NVIDIA. Mali licensees Companies that are current licensees of the Mali GPU designs include Rockip, Olwina, Samsung. Sales and market share, ARM-based CPU market share in 2010, over 95% in smartphone market. 10% in mobile computers. 35% in digital TVs and set-top boxes. However, ARM did not have any market share in servers and desktop PCs. As of 2014, over 50 billion ARM chips have been produced, 10 billion of which were produced in 2013 and ARM-based chips are found in nearly 60% of the world are Euro unregistered trademark S mobile devices. In the fourth quarter of 2010, 1.8 billion chips based on an ARM design were manufactured. With Microsoft's ARM-based Windows 8 OS, market research firm IHS predicted that in 2015 23% of all the PCs in the world will use ARM processors. In May 2012, Dell announced the Copper platform, a server based on Marvella Euro unregistered trademark S ARM powered devices. In October 2012, ARM announced the first set of early licensees of the 64 bit capable Cortex A57 processor. ARM's goal is by 2015 to have ARM based processors in more than half of all tablets, mini notebooks, and other mobile PCs sold. Partnerships Microsoft, at 2011 CES, Microsoft revealed that Windows 8 operating system will run on ARM architecture platforms. Following this, Microsoft demonstrated Internet Explorer 10. For around 30 seconds of the 90-minute talk, they mentioned that some of the demos were running on an ARM computer. During Microsoft's presentation of Windows 8 on June 1, 2011, a handful of the company's hardware partners showed off tablets and notebooks running the OS including ARM instead of Intel or AMD. University of Michigan, in 2011, ARM renewed a five-year, $5 million research partnership with University of Michigan, which extended their existing research partnership to 2015. This partnership will focus on ultra-low energy and sustainable computing. Senior Management, Warren East was appointed Chief Executive Officer of ARM Holdings in October 2001. In the 2011 financial year, East received a total compensation of a £1,187,500 from ARM, comprising a salary of a £475,000 and a bonus of a £712,500. East said in March 2013 that he would retire from ARM in May, with President Simon Cigars taking over as CEO. In March 2014, Former Wrexham chairman Stuart Chambers succeeded John Buchanan as chairman. Chambers, a non-executive director of Tesco and former chief executive of Nippon Cheat Glass Group, had previously worked at Mars and Royal Dutch Shell. See also, Imagination Technologies Arcade International, References. External links, Official Website.